Namaskar. Welcome back to your channel Simplify Your Space. In today's video, I will talk about renter friendly kitchen countertop organization. I moved into this rented flat a few weeks back. In the first phase, I completed the deep cleaning and basic setup of the kitchen to jumpstart my routine from this home. You can see more about them in the last two videos. Now in the next phase, my plan is to make my kitchen more functional and appealing for everyday usage. This kitchen does not have many cabinets, so keeping things tidy without clutter is important. But at the same time, I wanted to avoid any drilling and nailing, which is always a sore point between owners and tenants. I have made use of space efficient organizers from Amazon and today's video is made in collaboration with Amazon. Now let's get started. So I ordered a few things from Amazon according to the needs of the kitchen. This time I ordered a few wooden and metal organizers to have more of an earthy look. And once they arrived, I decided to make use of them immediately. First, I emptied the kitchen countertop to have a better view. Empty space helps me visualize and plan the final setup a little better. I started with the back countertop first. Here I placed this metal microwave stand which I already had. On the top shelf, I placed a wooden plank to add some wooden elements to match up with the theme. Below I place the air fryer and electric kettle and the top shelf is utilized to keep the microwave. This kind of rack really helps utilizing vertical space and arrange the small appliances neatly. As all the appliances are kept here, next to the rack I place the mixer grinder. To help organize all the chopping boards and lids, I place this wooden plate rack here. And next to this comes this wooden two-tier rack. The top is utilized to store water bottles and bottom for storing ceramic jars and mortar and pestle. To organize the sink area, I have placed this metal caddy on the wall which comes with self-adhesive hooks and placed this dishwashing and hand-washing liquid bottles on it. It also has space to store the dish scrubbing sponge. There is also a small rod to hang the towel. A good organizer to keep the sink area neat. With this back countertop is done. Let's move to the other side. Here I have open shelves which are utilized to keep the jars of spices and snacks. Here on this side I have placed this under the shelf metal rack which is utilized to store the box of whole spices. Attached to this are two rods which can be utilized to store kitchen roll, cling wrap, foil paper, etc. Now on this corner, I have placed this beautiful two-tier wooden rack. The top part is utilized to store oil dispensers and a ghee pot. The bottom part has this ceramic jars of sugar, tea and salt. Next to this, I have placed this lovely looking handcrafted wooden cutlery organizer which is used to store wooden spatulas, pair of scissors and knives and cutlery. On this side, I have placed this two-tier metal basket to store onions and potatoes. Next to the cooktop, I have placed a large metal hot pot stand to keep hot pans and vessels with cooked food. To enhance the look of the kitchen, I got this wooden coffee mug holder which looks so beautiful and aesthetically eye-pleasing. But I didn't want to hang it on the wall as it will require drilling. So with the help of zip ties, I have hung this mug holder on the kitchen window grill which looks great here. And this is utilized to organize all the coffee mugs and teacups which were taking lot of space on the countertop. And with this, our kitchen countertop is done. To decorate it only a bit more, I have placed a kitchen sign using a self-adhesive hook and added a couple of planters. This side is kept empty for the refrigerator 
and you will see that soon. And that's all about it. Now my kitchen is looking much more organized, neater and beautiful. Organizers when used tactfully can really help organize, maximize and beautify this space. They help make your cooking routines and workflow in the kitchen smoother and faster. Links for all the products shown in the video are given in the description box. A word of caution. Do not buy anything or everything that looks appealing on social media. Do apply your thoughts whether the selected item will add any value to your home or will just add to the clutter. Secondly, to make most of your money, you can plan your purchases when they are available at discounted deals. Like today and tomorrow, there is Amazon Prime Day sale where you can find great deals and discounts on thousands of products. If you need a product that can add value to your life, you can make good use of this sale. Introducing new products and making videos is part of the job of any social media influencer. It is a simple and effective way to inform consumers about the existing products and new launches without spending a bomb. Hope you enjoyed these ideas. Thank you for watching this video. Please give a thumbs up and share this video with your family and friends. Do subscribe to our channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook for all the latest updates and video notifications. We'll see you all next week. Happy organizing from Simplify Your Space. Bye-bye.